Toronto, streaks are not built on blowouts alone. There have to be a few nail biters along the way just to keep things interesting. But this was above and beyond. The Indians ruin Canada Day for the Blue Jays on Friday as they set a franchise record with their 14th straight twin, a 19-inning 2-1 triumph at Rogers Center. The Jays, who had manager John Gibbons and two players ejected, lost for the eighth time in their last 12 games. The six-hour, 15-minute affair was the Indians' longest game since they played 21 innings against the Twins on August 31, 1993. Carlos Santana won it with a lad off homer in 19th inning against Toronto second baseman Darwin Barney. He was the second Toronto position player to pitch in the game after the Blue Jays ran out of pitchers. Trevor Bauer, 7-2, Saturday's scheduled starter, came out of the bullpen and threw five scoreless innings for the victory. Closer Cody Allen, the only tribe reliever who didn't pitch, was unavailable after throwing three days in a row. The 14-game streak is the longest in franchise history and the longest in the big leagues since it landed to 1-14 in 2013. It's the longest streak in the American League since the A's won 20 straight in 2002. The first part of the game was spent in a pitcher's duel between Josh Tomlin and Marcus Stroman. They pitched to a 1-1 standoff. Tomlin allowed one run on seven hits in six innings. He struck out eight and walked two. Stroman, who had lost four of his last six decisions, allowed one run on five innings in six and two-thirds innings. He struck out six and walked one. The game started in an angry place and the ill will kept building. After the Indians went quietly in the first, plate umpire Vic Carapates ejected D.H. Edwin Incarnation when he slammed his bat and argued after striking out to end Toronto's half of the first inning. Manager John Gibbons arrived on the scene and was promptly ejected as well. It was the beginning of a long day for Carapates as the Blue Jays had problems with his strike zone throughout. In the 13th, Carapates ejected catch Russell Martin after he struck out to end the inning. The Indians took a 1-0 lead in the third on Santana's lad-off double and a single by Jason Kipnis. Strimmon retired the next 12 batters before Lonnie Chisenhall singled to start the seventh. Tomlin held the Blue Jays scoreless through the first five innings, but not without some turmoil and a little help from Carapates' strike zone. He pitched out of bases loaded jams in the fourth and fifth innings and had two out in the sixth when Justin Smoke hit a first pitch homer over the left field fence to tie the score. Smoke came into that at bat 0 for 7 against Tomlin. It was the 19th homer Tomlin has allowed in.